Todd, here is the complaint. I will stop sex trafficking immediately. I'm just trying to find good jobs for those ladies. Are you, are you doing this out of this building? Yeah, I mean, it's a nice office, it's convenient. I'm here a lot of the day, so when I moonlight, this is where I do it. Well, moonlighting as a rule is frowned upon. The show? No, I... Or the practice of holding a second job. I think everyone around here generally enjoys the show. Because the first season like, really holds up. Yes, when it was a sort of uh, will they or won't they, but then yes. once they once actually they did... did it, there it, was it, no story left to tell. The bloom was off the rose. Yeah. Todd, what you do in your own time is your business. That's not the complaint. Could I ask you, just take a brief sabbatical from eating the carrots? I mean, you put baby carrots out there like that, they're gonna be awfully tempting. Who can resist? Todd, I'm going to tell you what the complaint is. Okay. You apparently have not refilled the soap dispenser in the ladies' washroom on the second floor. God damn it! How often do you need that soap dispenser refilled? Well, I, I think only as often as it's empty. Jesus, I feel bad about that now. Oh, you do feel bad? I do feel bad about that. The finger you're okay with? The finger I'm okay with. Sex trafficking. These ladies come from the Ukraine. It's very oppressive there. They need to find work. I feel bad about that soap dispenser, ma'am. I'm gonna do that right now, as soon as I'm off my break. How much time is left on your break? Two hours. That's, that seems rather excessive. I was told I make my own schedule. Who, who would have told you this? Your boss? My boss. The guy you work under? You know that this is my company. There's another guy. Did you switch to potato chips? These are like a layer with salt and pepper. Mm-hmm. It was wonderful. They're crisp cut. Mm-hmm. Very good. Crinkled. Crinkled.